I'm Morgan Geringer. I'm the head of the Special Collections Department at UNT Libraries. My name is Anna Esparza. I am the Program Project Specialist for UNT Special Collections. UNT Special Collections has contributed over 250,000 unique items to the Portal to Texas History. The Portal to Texas History uh, is an online repository that collects cultural heritage materials from partners all across the state with millions of items available online for anyone to see. And each one of those unique items requires a metadata record associated with it that makes that item searchable and findable for our researchers. What metadata creation means is really trying to take all the information that you possibly can about one type of document or material that you have in front of you, which could be where it was created, who created it, what was it about, what is the significance to the community or to the collection which it came from. One of the things that we want people to understand about metadata creation is how much work is going on behind the scenes to bring these digital collections to life. These are not computerized generated words. We are actual people who view the records every day. We are getting the context, you know, we are inspired by people's stories. We are just always in all of the materials that we have. When we apply the metadata to the record, we are also applying a little bit of ourselves. We have over 15 students engaged in metadata creation for our collections. It does become interesting sometimes. I found a metadata record that was titled Rap Concert. It ended up being a video of the group Public Enemy featuring Flava Flav, someone who was immediately recognizable to me, but to a, a younger generation, someone who they did not know. So we did go back and fix that record. It is always somewhat entertaining to see what the students really um, can take out of these records. They're a really great group of people. Each one has their own individual personality that they bring to the records that they are making visible. People should tune in to the metadata live streaming event, especially if they don't know like what metadata creation is and what goes on to creating uh, the keywords to put into the records for research. Especially during the month of October, which is American Archives Month, anything that we can do to bring advocacy and awareness to the work that we do in archives, preserving and saving history every day is a great thing.